The Humane Society of the Treasure Coast currently has dozens of dogs ready for adoption, and folks here were counting on some of these pups finding homes this weekend. Many of the dogs are going to spend their Saturday here at the U.S. Sailing Center of Morton County for the Doggy Paddle and Sail event. Boat rides for you and your dogs and maybe a chance to meet your new best friend. But now the fundraiser is canceled because of this toxic algae in the waters of Martin County. We just thought it was too much of a risk to take um, putting people in perhaps danger or their animals in danger of getting sick. And the dogs are hardly the only ones feeling the effects. Campers at the Jensen Beach Environmental Study Center are supposed to be on the water, but it's too dangerous. How are the local businesses being affected by this? Instead, they're in a classroom learning about toxic algae. We have to scramble and try and get a number of different things going for the kids. And residents say they've had enough. This is a situation that I've witnessed get worse and worse every single year. Residents packed the Martin County Commission emergency meeting Tuesday morning demanding answers and action, asking lawmakers to stop the discharges from Lake Okeechobee they believe are causing this problem. We have got to work. We've, you've got to be working on this 24-7 like Everyone's life depends on it. Commissioners say they have alerted state and federal officials they need help fixing this. The governor, though, says he can only do so much since the state does not control those discharges. We've had a rainy season. Um, the, um, they're discharging, and the, the feds are going to start putting up their money. Now, a number of beaches in Martin County were closed again today because of the algae in the water. At this point, no one's predicting when the beaches will reopen.